Hey friends, just an honest and real video. Had some time to meditate, clear my neuroses, get in a state of flow. I feel like talking about some useful tips in coping with the collapse because there's so much doom that surrounds us. You know, it's hard, it's easy to get lost in it and just live in that dark place of despair. So, I pacify myself with enjoyable but but mildly uh, skillful activities, getting lost in the moment, you know, stuff like that. Those are all very helpful. Animals, too, are a great help. Getting in the in that state of consciousness with them, you know, just simple-minded. And uh, trucking along. I feel like next year is going to be a great year. For us personally, but... The world might get topsy-turvy. So... We're all just doing our best to uh, survive all of this. You know, keeping your nervous system in check. It's enough work as is, getting proper amount of sleep. And then to throw doom on top of everything else. Talking about Christmas decorations. This is me not trying to say I am walking away from it at all. Quite the contrary, I intend on keeping up with the earthly vibrations and stuff. So what this was really about is just a reminder to my realists out there to really focus on your mental health at this point. Um, you know, we're all going to be ground to dust soon. So at the very least, you can try to resolve any conflicts and confront your shadow. Let's still have some fun. You have a few more years to uh, knock some things out. All right, mental health. Get 150 minutes of exercise weekly, moderate aerobic exercise, um, eat a well-balanced diet, avoid processed foods, yada yada, you know, get your mind right, sleep well, and um, journal or do some sort of reflecting so you're aware of your consciousness, you're aware of your, um, your conflicts. All right. Thanks for subscribing. Take care of yourself, Doomers. Realists. See ya.